All right, welcome to the Kaiser movie. Be specific, the Sniper Kaiser movie. We're doing this new build where we can pretty much get some super strong snipes as Kaiza in essentially 1v5. And the runes we are running for all these games are Hail Blades, Taste of Blood Eyeball, Ingenious, Triple Tonic, and Biscuits. And what we're going to do is use the Triple Tonic to get extra points in our W faster. So we come online because I still believe in the Sniper Kaiser is super strong, just takes a while to scale. We want to minimize that as much as possible. So yeah, I'll play a few games of this. Let's see how good the build actually is. Let's see how much fun it is. It's really good for champions that don't have a lot of dashes, which their team actually doesn't. We're into a brand mid. He's going to have heavy poke. And the build path we're going is Mad Immune first, and Ingenious Hunter helps charge up the tier faster and give us more loot and procs. Nobody hits me and gets away with it. Come on, come on. We traded him back, but we don't really want to be trading him. Just prioritizing farming. The darkness was beaten once. It can be again. So Manamune, Ludens into Crit Bloom. Those three items are the big power spike. And then we go, like, Shadow Flame, Death Cap. But once we have those three core items, we should be able to 1v5. But I think off Man Immune, we still get the Q upgrade. We're just not getting the E upgrade with this build, but we're not building on Nashers or Attack Speed Boots. Because we want Snipes. I wonder what boots would be better. I think we'll try cooldown boots and sort shoes in some of these games. We dodged it all. I'm gonna experiment different um, summoner spells too. I think ignite's really good because we can pick up early kills like that. But I do like barrier, but our ult is gonna give us a barrier. And then TP might be viable too in this matchup, where if Brand pushed me out of lane, I'd be able to right back into action. Yeah, that's nice. We start with a kill. We gotta get a tier. Get that stacking. I mean, they nerfed Kaiza a while ago, so if you don't have enough haste, you can't proc your plasma just off your W alone. I will make a difference here. Let's see. I think I could wait for 10 gold to get the Warhammer. Being a Star Guardian, I get to have my wish. The others who don't? I don't have Flash Ignite. I'm just going to chill back. I mean, I already got early kill. Very good for me. If he just procs his passive on me, he hits three spells. I pretty much have to base. I'm going to lose so much HP. I missed a bunch of minions. I never liked you. I've never used this Kaiser skin before. It actually feels weird. It almost feels like a whole different champ auto attack wise. But the nice thing about Kaiza is her Q just last hits for ya. Oh, he's panicking. Nice. Activate the plasma and we'll just chill. Okay, we got a lot of potions in our inventory. Let's make sure Kindred's not here. She not here. Growing up means making your own hope. Did 
the hail blades is nice on this build because it helps us activate the uh, plasma too. Kaiser's passive has a lot of damage built into it. Not alone. I'm Kindred not spot. Afraid. I'm surprised I haven't needed to use my biscuits yet. Brand isn't doing a good job at poking me. He's not using his empowered E on the wave. That can't miss me. I guess I'll start burning my mana just because I gotta use these uh, biscuits. to make this right. If I keep him pushed into turret, he'll lose more minions. If I freeze. Also, we're not going to be putting more points in our alt. We're just going to put one in. If I can remember, I have a really bad habit of just always putting an alt point in alt when it's up. Uh-oh. All right, we got a little move speed with E. Good reason to use our biscuits. I still have this elixir force. What does it do? Give me 20 adaptive force for a minute. It's kind of hard to time, but you'd want to use it in a fight. Could ult in Q auto ignite him, but he's not quite low enough. I have a chance of dying for sure. I suppose we'll base after this. Like the universe. Good man I do. I First item complete. Then we'll go Ludens next. Ludens just got buffed too. It has more haste, right? Did it always have 25? I think it got more. Look at the moat. Okay, we need 20 more AD. They want a fight? I'll give them a fight. Hmm, you know what? Maybe starting with a Doran's over a Longsword is better then, because then I have 10 more AD towards that Q upgrade. I would get it earlier, but I think I'm still going to get it when I finish Ludens, because the mana from the Ludens converts into AD from the mana mirror. So we'll have to test it. A different game, I'll go Doran's and see how much faster we get the Q upgrade. Because getting the Q upgrade is pretty important. It's the majority of our damage for the first half of the game. It's all of our damage for the first half of our game. Oh, I got the free skill point. Push forward, never waver. Might be getting ganked, but I have a move move behind me. The darkness was beaten once. Go in for it a wee bit of poke. I'm getting ganked. What I can do is auto her, then just alt behind her. Oh, nice, I burned her all. So that's an easy way to escape from ganks. The mission comes first. Doing pretty solid damage. We almost killed Kindred. Oh, that hit him through the minion. We need to base. He also does too. I mean, we can maybe get this if he doesn't. It's a little risky. If he presses E and stuns it's me or ult. Save the world. Yoink. Worth. I might die now. He's gonna like flash ignite. I need to just sit back. It was not worth.
he's rushing Leandri's. This build actually does a lot of damage versus people who build health. Magic resist does kind of counter it. Well, I'm not going to be able to hit anything here. The grubs are going to get in the way. I'm just going to reset really quick. Grab this. Can't really buy anything else. Oh, we need only two more AD. You know, I think it'd be the same if I had a Doran's or not. I mean, I would get the upgrade here, but just a few more stacks on this and I'll have my Q upgrade. I need one more AD. And to stack up the mana we either auto attack or we just Q for use abilities. But we have three of the grubs, so I do pretty solid damage to turrets. I missed finally. No I need to get a hit on this turret and I can kill it. But I gotta back up because he's gonna use the wave to poke me. Nice. The thing is, we're gonna hit the Q upgrade and the W upgrade around the same time. I just need 100 AP for the W upgrade. I will make a difference here. I have to. Alright, we're not putting a point. Oh, I got the Q upgrade from leveling up. We're not going to put a point in the alt, because what does it give us extra? Extra range, which is decent. Cooldown, decent, but not much shield amount. Whereas having more points in W is going to help once we get this upgrade. Wait, W's already maxed out. <laughs> I think putting points in alt, though, over E might be better, though, since I'm not upgrading E. I can buy 50 more HP. We need enough to get this alternator plus one more book. Or a dark seal, I guess. My inventory might get too cluttered if I get dark seal. But I'm down to try it some game. Uh, really need to get my face off. Fight here, though. Nice, take him out. I need to get a, at least an assist on this guy. I don't know if that works. Smite that. Nice, I bursted her. Either she didn't have ult or I was able to burst her. I'll just put points in our. An oath is more than just words. It's a promise. I'm doing a lot of damage. And I have Ludens here. So we get our W upgrade. And we're online. You really just need two items to come online, but the third item is uh, when the damage hits. Uh, this upgrade, you know, I don't think they're going to build that much MR this game. I'm going to try cooldown boots, because the more CR, the better actually for sniping. It's it's a trade-off. You can either do Sork Shoes and hit a bit harder. Sork Shoes, I'd say, build against if they're going to build MR. I have a feeling they're not, because we had a fed MF, and it looked like I'm going AD. So, cooldown boots give me a higher chance of bursting people with plasma. So now... Oh my god. Oh, that went right through them. 
As long as the Herald doesn't get in the way. But since I have CDR boots, this is almost back up. And, like, this is the spot where this build excels. Oh, he is angry. Because there's nothing besides this Herald to block the snipes. Turn. I missed a few snipes there. I actually could have gotten way more kills. Oh, I was lying. <laughs> oh no. I'm dead. He's gonna help me. I'll take her with me. <laughs> Okay, I'm so strong. And we go Crypt Bloom because this over Void because it gives about the same um, magic uh, pen and AP, but it gives haste. And we need haste for snipes. If you could swap any ults to any camp, what combo would you choose? Uh, I don't know. There's too many combinations. I'm not gonna lie. There's still time to make this right. Do we go after Crypt Bloom? It's either uh, yeah, it's probably Rabidons then Shadow Flame, or the Zonias or Banshees. Those all give a lot of AP. Fling him into turret, though. I think he wins that. An ally has been slain. Well, I'm here to clean up. You have slain an enemy. My mid turret. Eyes on the horizon. I like playing Kaiza, Sniper Kaiza, but I like the three upgrade Sniper build too, where you go Eclipse first. But I think this is actually stronger, because with the Eclipse build, I end up just playing Sniper Kaiza anyway. Like, the Eclipse helps you get through the early game. That doesn't go that far. Would have hit. There's a Kindred around here, I think. Luden's done 850. This is upgraded. Just a teenage girl with a magical bunny shooting starlight. Nothing new. Where are they? I want to snipe them. Together, stars light the universe. Well, I dodged all his spells. Oh, he's got two MR items already. Well, that's cool. Well, he's dead. Alright. If I would have had this, I would have beat him. But I didn't base. We just go Death Cap next. Death Cap Shadow Flame, I think. I can go Hourglass Banshees if I really need to. Oh, no. The throws, we've been aced. What is happening, bot lane? Your 
them a fight. Healing's only one and two. Brand has a shutdown. Kindred, wow. How did the Kindred get so fed? Our mark is lifted. If there's minions in the way, I can't snipe. I need to let my frontline, my Mumu, go in. Wow, they keep just randomly moving as soon as I snipe. Okay, that one shouldn't have hit. Wow. Oh, my Q didn't go off. Or it did, it just... Was it on cooldown before I jumped? That was weird. My Q didn't hit anything there. That's weird. Must poke. Poke, poke, poke. Oh, there we go. There we go. I have a feeling Mordekaiser is going to just try to run behind me again. Hopefully they're not on Baron. Kindred and Mord could maybe duo it here. I don't know why I have a feeling they're on Baron. Oh, Hextech Dragons. Good. Yep, they got Baron. I called it. They weren't showing on the map anywhere. Nice. Picked another one. We don't lose an inhib on this bear and we're looking pretty good. Oh my god. I'm stopping them from even being able to lock up. Oh. She's a goner. Oh, really good. I had to flash away because Nord was about to hit me. Alright, that's good. We kited back perfectly for the, the Amumu re-engage. I'm surprised. What was Brand? Oh, Brand base because I got him low. And then I can just ult in and kind of... Uh, kick off the survivors. Oh, we get in him. They're dead for a while. I need blue buff. Cool. Oh, I have death cap. As long as Mord doesn't just TP behind me and kill me here. There he is. Oh, it's over. Shadow Flame, or... I mean, I go a different item, or actually, I wish I could afford the rod, but I guess I gotta go Shadow Flame. I get to have my wish. The others who don't, I fight for them. I just need vision of them. Fights in the river are so good for me. I mean, we don't really need to go mid. Since we already have a... Uh, we need to kill this guy after he kills her. We guardians face our fears. Oh, he didn't get her. Oh my god. Okay. Through his magic resist item, I am popping him now. I mean, what does this do? 47% missing health damage. So yeah, if I activate the plasma, it pretty much kills them. Because in order to activate the plasma, I have to do that much damage. I have to do like half of their health. I will make a difference here. 
Oh, that's a good center off. That actually stops their ports. They're trying to push mid to stop us from pushing bot, but we have an in hit, so they can't really... They're not going to out-push us, especially with Gnar there. And Kindred died. Oh my god. <laughs> Through the minions. Caitlyn, the long-range champ, doesn't even get to play versus me. Time to go. I could get a Horizon too, but I think Shadow Flame is better. I just need Magic Pen. Since I don't have Magic Pen boots. Yeah, I think Kindred's going for this. We need to stop her. It's a promise. This will reveal her by killing this crab. Oh, so close. I don't think we flip it. She's gonna outsmite. If I just hit some poke. <laughs> oh, yeah, and it makes the uh, Crypt Loom activate more. Well, Brand got a triple kill. I mean, I haven't seen him participate in the last few fights. Probably because he's been poked out. But he did just kill my whole team. Now we don't get Baron. I'm gonna go get Shadow Flame. Oh, wait. Hold on. Who is this? He flashed on me. Thought he was gonna ult me. It might come through here. What are those minions doing? Oh, I need to run. If we can kite back out of these minions, I can stop them from going in. Oh my god, he died in two folks! Dude! Oh, I would have got all of them. The snipes! 17 kills, see? We came online. 3300 on this. 2300 on that. Healed a lot with Crypto Room, too. That was too yeah, I don't even have the, uh... Oh, he's looking for me. Oh, no. He found someone else. Um, I think Kindred still has ult, so... Kite back. Oh, I needed to hit that. Oh, back up. Oh, she got way too close. I don't know why Senna walked in melee range. You gotta check Farron. Wow, that is uh, tragic. Could have autoed her again, but I thought she was gonna die. I mean, at this point, I can sell my boots and buy Horizon. <laughs> I wonder what's better, Horizon or Storm Surge? Probably Horizon. Oh my god. They're screwed. They they have to get to me. Like, Leona or Mord has to like flash on me and ult me or whatever. Because at range, they just they can't beat me. Ari 
I am pretty slow now, though, but I have flash up. But I do massive amounts of damage. What a hit. I mean, I'm just winning the fight by not even going near them. <laughs> Who's still alive? Kate. Where's Caitlyn? Go passive damage? It's at 60% missing health. I kind of want them all to spawn again just so I can open fire. Oh, my Q's actually not doing as much. Oh my. Oh. I gotta get to safety. Are they coming? Baron's a good spot to fight. Uh, Senna? I think she got creep blocked. <laughs> what happened? The darkness was beaten once. It can be again. Damn. That shouldn't have revealed me. I'll get you. Oh. The mission comes first. Oh, I hit the wrong one. Well, Kate's got a base. Injured's kind of low, but she has ult. Injured's really low. They're in a choke point. Oh my god. Oh my god, I might have just sent it. I trolled. I was this close to throwing the game right there, I'm not gonna lie. Kindred attacking. What are you doing? Oh, we don't have a turret here. Are you kidding me? Run! Alright, Brand's busy dealing with the minions. Ah, uh, there's too many minions for me to snipe. I will make a difference. I have ult again. But I hit a minion. Oh, how does that not hit? Oh my god, they're so close. All right, we get Hextech Soul here, I think. I need a blue potion. Yeah, that was so close. At least I can 1v1 more because he hasn't really gotten stronger. He didn't buy any more MR. That was scary, though. Alright, I can poke them all in Baron. Kindred's really the main threat. Brand is too, but Brand like just eats my spells. Oh my god, it did 1700 damage! He 
she's so fast. Oh, I hit her. Really. We did it. Oh, that's actually a fantastic first game. Twenty-three kills, two deaths, so many snipes, almost six K on that. Thirty-six hundred on that. I hurt. I think the shadow flame is nice because it makes my plasma passive crit. So they're like for sure dead. See the damage. Oh, let's play this again. 85k damage. Nice. It's so fun. I love playing sniper builds. All right, we got Survival game needs. two. We're going to try the Doran's Blade start. And we may try the Sork Shoes if they build some MR. They got a lot of frontline, a lot of champions that are going to eat the Ws. But they have some really strong early champs. So we might not get as fed as fast. Get it. I came back Aurelia mid up. is... One of my least favorite things to play into just because he dashed through the wave and kills you. If she didn't just heal the full off every time she dashed, I'd be okay with it. But she just goes Blade of the Rune King first, Exploit so I'm going to sit back. She doesn't have healing yet on first base, but I think she still has some built-in healing with the Q. I just don't want her to stack it up all the way, but she can prep a bunch of minions for it. Try to stun it. I don't think I can get her. If I flash auto, I still need a few autos. Uh, she doesn't have TP, and is this pushing into me? It's not, is it? I think I still just leave it, because it's too early for me to base. I can still deny her a lot of minions off this wave. Oh, it is pushing into me. No, it's not. <laughs> it's... Close to even, but yeah, it'll push into her. Exploit their mistakes. If I have a huge wave, it's harder for her to fight me too. Stay alert. Stay aggressive. We can use this tonic to push also. Since it gives me, what, five extra damage? A moving target lives longer. We might get ganked by Kha'Zix here, though. She might miss some of these, but Aurelia has really good last hitting under turret. But I can use this time to reset. They were up 11 minions, 10 minions. I was about to say, nobody's died yet. Their team has. Oh, we have a Zach support. Interesting. Kha'Zix top. So now she's going to slow push this wave into me and try and just look for a stun. I fucked up. Oh. Aurelia doing Aurelia things. That's actually fine. I like equally traded her there. This place is beautiful. I'm going to save it. Should be able to get most of these. I think the minions are gonna screw them up. I miss one. Uh, I'm gonna push this just because I feel like she based here. It's a good day for a hunt. Oh, 
All right, we'll play base roulette. Do I get boots or sword? I think I just take all the damage I can to try and beat her early. Oh, she's getting armor first. Okay. She doesn't like my autos. That's good. I mean, if she just came back to lane with Vampiric, I would never be able to kill her because every time she dashes, she heals like 100 HP for some reason. I don't have to remember. Nice. The jungler got three grubbies. Got hit again. Okay, she's starting to hurt. Can't get hit by those stuns. She can kill me at this HP. I'm going to have to flash away if she hits another stun. And even then, I might still die. Okay, we're good. Hey, I do have my ult to jump away, but... She's just too good at the game, you know? She just keeps dashing. An enemy has been slain. This world is changing. We okay, I was gonna push if she roamed. You're the hunted. Okay, she's not pushing now, because she wants to kill me. She wants me to walk out. And then she's gonna dash in and stun me for all. Me. Get up, stand firm, strike hard. Can't go for that minion back there. Dropped her stack of rooms. Hold our ground. Attack them in theirs. But I, I just can't walk up. She's just gonna one shot me. An ally has been slain. An enemy has been slain. Oh, trees. How I missed them. We will leave this place. And she got a gank. Ugh, the wave is still in a really bad spot. Survival. If I get an Amumu gank ever, we could kill her. That's just Aurelia, though. She's kind of like an auto win champ. This is why I I'll outscale her, I think, as long as she doesn't just pick up a bunch of free kills from my teammates. She based here, that's bad. She could have held me in lane and made me base first. I think I mana me. Oh, we're so close. Really buying it. Yep, she's got vampiric armor boots. So she out damages me and out heals me, so I need to be careful. Let's ask for a gank. I mean, if he does the dragon, that's fine. Kha'Zix top. Just so lame. He just charges that. It doesn't take any damage. Skin is and 
I'm trading her well. Ooh, this skill point. Learn from me. Let's see what you made of. Not the plasma. The thing is, like, she's gonna heal back to full off this wave. I really need somebody to help me. Aurelia is like only beatable by ganks. She's just stat checks and wins every fight. I take it. That's fine. Unfortunately, I got stunned under turret. But I'll take it. We got a kill. I think she ignited me too. No. Alright, on to. The Ludens. Oh yeah, I was worth a shutdown. That actually wasn't worth it. I get punished for playing better than her. For farming better. I mean, it's only 150 extra gold, but that's kind of lame. Thanks, Riot. I get punished because my support's 4-0. I get punished because my jungler Remember the name. does not know my lane exists. Well, I get a free kill off roaming. We need to be careful. She's over here. Amumu's pretty strong into her, though. Shut down. Monsters are everywhere. Well, there's support got the shutdown. That's good. Oh, I got Q upgrade already. Okay. We do get the Q I like upgrade, it. I think, a bit faster. I mean... I think we're later in this game than the other game. I'm not sure. But we don't have many kills. I mean, I'm winning lane versus one of the most broken champs in the game, so... But she finally missed that. As you can see, she just autos me. Ooh, maybe my support will gank me. Because my jungler really doesn't want to gank an Aurelia who's sitting under my turret all game. I'm beating her on my own. Oh, she's panicking. Uh, I had to flash, unfortunately. My plasma ran out and I ran out of vision. That's good, though. Feed the beast. Anything to shut her down, because she's probably tilted that she doesn't have 10 kills. She's a sweaty Aurelia player. Alright, we got maxed out W. I actually cancelled that. Like, we're gonna win this game so easy, but like, the lane phase is just so hard. We need 40 more AP so we could get I survived the void. Alternator and book, I guess. I don't know if I'm going cooldown boots or swords. I think cooldown boots. See what happens? This is what I was waiting for all game, just a gank. Because Aurelia can go in, but she can't get out. But Amumu's like, yeah, he'll f she'll figure it out on her own.
I think I'm liking the cooldown boots. The haste, just to get more snipes, is just so much better, I think. Why do you need ganks? Oh yeah, you finally start getting ganked when you should be getting camped all game. Come on, let's go. I'll be back. I don't see the point of putting more points into oh man, I could buy the Dark Seal and get the upgrade, but eh. More points into E, like, it's 5% move speed, 10% attack speed, though, but I like, I don't know. What do you mean? Didn't I solo kill her? I solo killed her under turret. I didn't get a gank, did I? Oh, yeah, Sivir came. Well, she's got Blade of the Ruin King, so even if she's behind a level, she's still stronger than me. Really, a player's egos. The hunt will resume. Hmm. Actually, better not to buy the item here and buy the book so I can get my upgrade. Get up. Stand firm. Really is gonna pick up some shutdowns here. Close my eyes and listen to shutdown, shutdown. I came for the hunt. Yes. Hey, Zach killed her. <laughs> Amumu saved the blobbies. Yeah, the thing is, Aurelia can miss everything and still, like, just beat me, so it's like, of course I have to play safe. You pick the champion that forces me to. Oh my god. I didn't know what that was at first. Oh no. Survival means never stop. The boy. We got a lot of smack talking in this game. We got the haste. It needs to feed. If it doesn't, could I be next? It's like I'm playing an ADC Monsters building AP. We'll I can't one v one the champion that's specifically right. building to one v one. But I am outplaying her by not one v wanting her, and that's why she's upset. Do we go for the solo kill, lads? I don't think Kha'Zix can fight me. You should be able to 1v1 him. Oh my god. That's a little bit. Q. 
Alright, well... I mean, we hit our two item power spike. This game's definitely not going as long as the other one, though. This Zack is popping off. Zack is like one of the most broken champions right now, though. You could play him anywhere. I mean, I wanted to ult in there and steal that kill, but it's like, I'll just do it for this one. Yo, I'm dead as fuck. Wait, what did she just attach to? She like grabbed onto right here from over here. It looked like she was grabbing onto the ward. Yeah, it hit the three item power spike. Zach does too much damage for healing so much and having so much CC. She grappled the dead turret, but it latched on here instead of here when she shot it like this. I don't know. Maybe I'm blind. Hunters must be nimble and walk lightly. I just hate playing against Aurelias because, like, you can't tell if they're good or not because they're all the same. They all just dash through the minions and one-shot you. Like, there's really not much skill expression. She looks like a skillful champ, but she's not. She's so, so easy to play. Well, I guess we just win. They cannot kill the Zack support, who is probably stronger than me. Ooh, could you? The thing is, their death timers are really short. See that minion clear? Stay alert. <laughs> Stay alert. and everything. I mean, didn't didn't Aurelia get a gank from Kha'Zix? I got him. I mean, she really, she really did deserve this win, though. She really did dash through those minions really good. This place is beautiful. I'm going to save it. I'll give her that. Death cap, cover to me. If I had a dark seal and a Doran's, I, I just wouldn't have room for even a large rod here. I'd have to sell one of the two. The thing is, I don't even think Zack was close to losing that. Dude, what does that damage? <laughs> Look at that. I'm zoning him all off. Just by pressing W. Alright, that's a 
I kind of thought I'd be able to kill him, but no. I think selling the Dorans for another large rod is worth as long as you don't lose Q upgrade, but I'm at 145. I'm not even close. Oh, everybody had to stop what they're doing to go kill Aurelia. I like that. You want some tips, Aurelia? I'll help you out for free. Not bad. We probably would have won the game a little bit faster if Amumu ever decided to gank. I did the most damage, even though I was just kind of farming all of that game. All right, game three we got against a mage. So we had to deal with the annoying Aurelia. It was bearable. I've been banning a Kali every game, in case you're wondering. We could probably do better into her than the Aurelia, but I just don't like playing against a Kali because she can like do terrible in lane and then just press R and just kill the whole team. But yeah, Vagar, I wanted to take Cleanse, but sometimes I run over my lanes so hard where the Cleanse is just not really needed. Because the only things I can cleanse are the Vagar Cage, maybe a Kate Trap, but I'll still take the auto, and then Lux Snare. But if I end up dodging all of that, we're fine. And then Ignite gives me way higher chance of snowballing if I can get an early kill because of it. Because a lot of the combos I do are just alt in, auto Q, ignite. And that chunks them. Damn, this guy's kind of baiting me into this. What the hell is he doing? Alright. Well, whoever warded that red buff, thanks. I would have never uh, saw that one. Why was he so low? I thought Lee Sin has a pretty healthy clear. Or you're gonna die too. Kinda hoping I could detonate the plasma. Okay, I don't know why this game is so easy and the last game was like nightmare mode in lane. Well, yeah, they're, uh, they're not going to do too well because I'm going to scale so much faster now. Two kills. I got a base. Uh, if I didn't miss a few minions at the end there, I could have, oh, no, Wharf Hammer cost uh, this much. I'll do this, this. This second skin gave mm. me a second life. Moat and I will boots. Not take it I probably should have just went the second sword, but the boots. I need the boots. I don't have flash. Oh yeah, I have a jungler. Me like ganks. Don't take my cannon, I'll leave the game. Man, I'm only level 4. It feels like I should be level 10 already. I do like farming on Kaiser though, it's actually not too bad. Feed the beast. Or be its meal. Ooh, 
Lee Sin has the same farm as my jungler and he died. I return stronger than I Maybe Viego ganked somewhere. I don't know. I wasted my E walking forward here, I guess. Probably not the right thing to do, because if Lee Sin's here, then I got nothing to get away. Oh, hey, look, he's at the grubs. I like it here. And I now he's like not stay. at the grubs. Huh. Some seeds. It's fight or flight. Only now I do not run. I had a feeling that was going to hit a minion. I mean, if I shove him into turret, he's going to lose a lot of CS. This place so. is beautiful. Hello. I'm going to Oh, he's out of mana. He's got a base and TP. Oh, this skin has a helmet too I put on. Like a mask. I'm gonna go for this. Might not be worth. Oh, I got it. Good thing we have the grubs. What is this? Oh no. Wait, that's another jungler? That's a top laner. Excuse me. I came back for the others who could not. I'm hit. Well, I overstayed. I need to find a way to get out of this lane. Alright, we got an out. Wait, how much do I need, guys? 200 gold. Might as well stay. It's fight or flight. Only now, I do not run. Now he could potentially kill me because I might not have enough mana to ult. Oh, I might have needed to not miss that mana. Ooh, I needed that minion. I mean, I could have just based and sold the potion, but... I use my E. My E actually pushes faster than my Q, I think. Just because I get to attack speed. See, Vagar screwed up, just like Aurelia did. Why did he need to base? I'm clearly, like, overstaying. You stay till I base, and then you shove wave into my turret so I lose one wave. Now he ends up losing a wave. When he was ahead. Well, he wasn't, he's not ahead, but, like, he was ahead for that wave. I don't know. I need to use some of this junk. I should have sold the potion anyway. I remember these. Reminds me of home. Ready to use TP? Oh, did he? I haven't been really paying attention. It's a Friday night and I'm ready to go to bed at 10 p.m. Oh, I tried. Oh. How is this guy here again? A weird looking Lee Sin. What the? Damn, I wasn't in range to ignite. 
go. There's no way he's on grubs, right? He's like one HP. Ah. He's on grubs. Bro died to the grubs. I don't see that every day. Well, we could get a lost chapter. Oh, I'm scared of this object. I know I've said a lot of champions are broken right now. But yeah, nothing tops that guy. We didn't even mention him because everybody just knows he's broken. We could do this. Everybody just knows Cassante is broken, okay? Tell yourself you will live. Believe it, Kaisa. And you will have a chance. Oh my god, where does health go? <laughs> Wait, we need one of these grubs. We need the last grub. I was spared for this. Where is it? I have a feeling my prediction Lee Sin's gonna jump over the wall and attempt to steal it. Okay. Well, I made Vagar base for the tenth time now. I need the attack speed. I suppose I'll base. Oh, I got Q upgrade. I didn't need to sell those biscuits. I'm just never using them. If I sell them, I still get the extra mana, so. I probably could have kept them for a bit. Alright, we're almost at our power spike. We just need to hit next base. Ah, I don't care. Wow. Man. Wasn't really expecting to kill him there. I thought he was going to flash, and then I was going to have to flash after him to get the more autos. But I got Q upgrades, so it kind of does double damage now. Kind of a machine gun. I mean, I'm I'm up double his farm, so he's just so far behind. Cassante, though, yeah, I'm not fighting him. I came for the hunt. Stay for the Lee Sin also can't fight me. I will one-shot him. Well, I, oh, he killed him. Oh, Viego's even. Well, he's not more broken, but Viego's broken too. Any champion that's been released or updated in the last few years is broken. All right, we got our power spike. We got the two items with the two upgrades. It's sniping time. I hate these skins where it's a. Either Omega or like the video game where it just puts some weird ass sound effect over with their voices. I'm terrible. This world is changing. We A two, a three. Snipe, snipe, snipe. Snipe, snipe, snipe. Snipe, snipe, snipe. Oh, I'm going really deep here. You know, 
I outplayed her. I don't know how... What even... How or what happened there, but... Snipe, snipe, snipe. Damn, she went the wrong way. She's got a lot of traps in that bush. Where's Lee Sin? I think he quit. Oh, no. Well, I almost died. I was not expecting Caitlyn to go all in for me. I mean, to be fair, I kind of knew this game was over the second I killed Lee Sin level 3 in his jungle. I think I was level 2. It's my Amumu. I mean, we had a different Amumu last game, but he really didn't do anything. He just kind of, uh, watched. I mean, where at least he's been level six for a long. T yeah, he's AFK. <laughs> he he left the game when he died to the grubs. Poor guy. I mean, at least we're hitting the power spike before 20 minutes. So like, this doesn't take super long to come online. When did I hit the power spike last game? Last game was like the most real of a game where it's like I actually had to like think in lane this I just autopilot just win I think last game I came online at like 20 minutes also feed the beast will be its meal I forgot to change my Kaiser skin for this game. I got a third skin. Mid is open as it has been all game. Jungle a open. Ooh. Yeah, I don't think Lee's too happy. Oh, trees. How'd she know to dodge that way? I mean, she probably knew another one was coming. Oh my god. Stop it. Help. No. He gonna kill me. I'm too young. I have fallen. Oh, wait, he's been playing. He's level 10. He's just AFK farming. Because he was level 6 last time we saw him. He's been playing, we just haven't been able to see where he's at. How did those Zyra root not hit?
We're getting uh, backdoored by Crisante. That's my wife, by the way. I just let her die. Sin down. Is this Kate scripting? Why does she just like net? I mean, have I hit Caitlyn with a W? She like she nets right when it's coming at her. Although a script, no, no, she's not. A script wouldn't even need the net to dodge. I think she's just got really good reaction time and she just spams E as soon as she sees the projectile flying at her. I love sniping. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy. Yeah, I could play this build all day, every day. walk out of base and they just get shown uh -oh. I did Lux of all people survive that I'm not base until you base. Where you at? Oh. Oh, you. We have a ribbon. 
Don't you go behind those minions. We have a ribbon? Please, no. I have a dead. I have another dead. Damn it! This Lex is dodging. We're dodging. Pretty shit. How do we not have that? There's Winions in the way. I'm out of mana. I gotta go. Okay, well now I do a lot of damage. Now if I hit two plaz or two W's, they just die. Oh, and I got a hex type. So. You know, I don't really like them sitting in the base because I can't snipe them. Just to get them in. when I used a W. Alright, GG. That was fun. I mean, it was a nice snipe sesh. I'm sure the enemy team was having fun, too. I see my damage. Forty six K. Second highest was sixteen thousand on Zyra on my team. Well GG. Alright, game four. This might be our final game. I might play one more after. We'll see. Got the bullet angel skin. This one uh eh, I might go back to the Spirit Blossom or Star Guardian, whatever it was I used for the first one. Believe it, Kaisa. We got another mage. We got Ari. Hopefully she gives me a good match. Amumu's gonna be annoying. His ganks are strong. I came back. I mean, her W just got hit by all the minions. I'm going to keep chasing her. Alright. I didn't get a one last auto. I don't think it would have killed her, but... Maybe it's a good thing. I would have baited myself into death. I was spared for a reason. I'm going to use my potion and biscuit, because... Usually when I'm pushed up this early in winning lane, we're going to get ganked by the mummy. Soon. Which is actually healing. 
Oh, she used both of her potions. I will make a difference. I just don't want him to gank from the top side. It's like that's where I don't have vision. Get up, stand firm, strike hard. All right, this kind of pushes into me now, so we can. Oh, we see a Mumu. We can zone her off. I'm a tank. I'm a tank. That was terrible. I got a Nidalee, though. I got a turret. I'm just gonna push in base. Oh my god, she has six farm. She missed. I might stay, actually. She's missing everything. Oh, she ain't missing that kill. Um, yeah, let's just base. She's got blue buff. No, I'm not base. Primary directive. Well, now she's even with me. Maybe she's ahead. I don't know if she flashed. Now she has unlimited mana, so now she can heal, basically. Lily, don't flip this, please. Gotcha. Gotta reset. I think I just leave. I'm not gonna out-sustain her. She has blue buff, unless... Uh... Nah, I'm just leaving. I don't want to risk dying. Nidalee can uh, kind of freeze my lane, stop her from pushing. I only lost two minions. Oh, I'm here. Oh, steal that. Oh my god. Oh boy. Well, you have a maiden, but do you have any of this so-called mana? Okay, Jace, you're not gonna win this. All right, I just need Ari not to charm me here. A moving target lives longer. Probably should have got boots. Should have, could have, woulda. More fighting. I came for the hunt. No, I just... Yeah, Nidalee is kind of perma fighting, but she's taking fights that she doesn't really win. Oh, she's zero three. This place is beautiful. I'm going to save it. <laughs> Alright, power farming. Hey, I probably should have done that a while ago. Oh, I got a red buff, though. Oh, it's about to run out. 
I'll heal to like half HP. Ari is a little difficult because I can't auto attack her without getting charm. Feed the beast. But also, if she didn't get two free kills from my jumbler. Too slow. Okay, she is. I mean, does she even need flash? She got dishy dash. She has no mana. I don't know where a Mumu is. I cannot hit a W on her though. I mean, I just stay as long as I can. She's got a reset. This skin lives on me and hunts me. I just use my adaptive potion or whatever it is. How much do I need? A lot. I don't think it's worth it to get CDR boots before the man immune. And honed by instinct. Pretty low mana. She's out of mana. We'll get her eventually. She has a bounty even though she's down 30 CS. Hold out ground. Attack them in theirs. But I don't really have an opportunity to kill her solo yet. I don't have as much sustain as her because she's just healing every time she levels up. Forgiveness is hard. I have a feeling a Moomoo's on Grubby. We hit her. GG. Come on. Come on. I was correct. I got one auto. You have to like move and dodge the charm. What is my Nidalee? Dang it, kill. I saw she was 1 HP. Ari also sees that she's 1 HP. I need to push. Nidalee, just don't fight her, please. Oh, she wants Caitlyn. Oh no. It's more worth it for me just to push mid. I'm not running all the way down there. Oh, she didn't see Kate. Oh, not Caitlyn. Oh my gosh, she's gonna get another dash though from killing Kate. Oh, Caitlyn lived. Okay, I really thought Kate was dead. Well, Pantheon gets to shut down. Oh no. Why do the Yorks always have to win so hard? I mean, he's not even like winning hard. It's just a moose fed because our Nidalee is doo doo. I'm not going to be able to snipe Yorick because of those minions. So this might be a loss. We'll see though. I mean, if I kill his whole team, then surely we can deal with him later. Okay, we got first item. We just need one more item now. Stay alert. Stay aggressive. I think this is a lot better than a moat. It gave me six AD. Oh, it gave me my upgrade. Well, she's got an alternator. I was hoping her ult wasn't back up yet. Uh, 
I'm kind of trolling. That was risky. Now this guy's the skin's weird. Doesn't it look like her butt's hanging out? I don't know. Come on, you can get away, bud. Wait, what am I buying? Huh. Void rule number one. Yep, don't. don't die. Need to lose. Oh my god, a Moomoo's still chasing me. I gotta get mid-wave, though. Ah, this is worth it. Oh, Moomoo's gonna die? Darn, he got away. Yeah, it's not good that Yorick has six grubs. I like it here. I just want to stay. I would have fought him, but I got creep locked into losing 20% of my health. I would die. I need W upgrade to kill a Moo Moo. I think he's going to dragon. Yeah, this is going to be a hard game. Oh no. Yeah, the issue is we don't like maybe Pantheon. No, I don't even think Pantheon will be able to fight Yorick. I hate Yorick. When I play Yorick, I get five people running for me all the time. When I'm, I got Yorick on the enemy team. Not one person on my team can fight Yorick. Enemy rampage. I return stronger than I left. Damn, they're kind of low. Oh, I need to put a point in W, not all. It's fine. <laughs> Sniper squad. He missed our. Oh my god, he's so low. Oh, Chase. What did you get yourself into, bud? I don't have enough, do I? I have to get the seal if I want the upgrade. I can wait, actually. Oh, wait. Come on. Yeah, let's go. Okay. Your team has destroyed a turret. I mean, Jace, I think, is only losing because of the Amumu games. Save the turret. Save the turret. My huh? AI will continue to learn every kill. But it still could use a little extra battery life. All right. Somehow, Nidalee is, like, doing stuff. But the second she just jumps into a moo moo, she's gonna die. I was spared for I have W upgrade, but it really doesn't do any damage yet. Oh no. An ally has been slain. What is happening down there? I really don't want to lose mid turret, but I'm probably going to lose mid turret anyway. I 
Pantheon had to leave the turret. Some recoil at the sight of me. Underneath the shell, they see I'm just like it. Has been destroyed. Finally. Um. Maybe we leave the turret up till we get objective bounties. I don't know. Tertiary directive. Peaches. I mean, surely Ezreal and Sona will come mid soon, and I can farm them. The only issue is I have no front line, and that's really necessary for Kaiza. I'm coming. I almost have mana immune upgrade. Primary direct kill. See, like I can't snipe him though, because he's always gonna have a big minion wave. I gotta kill the maiden. It's a good if the maiden's out. dead, then we're fine for a bit. Lose mid turret. Revealed. Your turret has been destroyed. Your turret has been destroyed. Shut down. Enemy double kill. Oh, I can't fight. There's nothing to do. Oh, actually, Caitlyn killed those. Now they have heralds, so they get more turrets. The moon moon. It's a good day for a hunt. There he is. I think our best chance is grouping, but we're really not as strong. But I can get picks. Okay. He do damage. I mean, the Ari's really weak. She's just hard to kill for me. Oh, snipers, roll out. That really hits me so. We gotta go top. Careful. Anger is useless to me. A We're gonna lose all the dragons, I feel. Oh no. Of course she has a damn Seraph bro. Get him. Yes! A moo moo down! Oh! That's good, that's good. Who's this? You're right? Get the maiden! Get the maiden! Get the maiden! Get her! He's pretty weak with no maiden. Ow! Bro, see that little minion just walked in front of me. Let me fight this still. Damn. Your counters me so hard. Need to get the dragon.
But that's going to be impossible. Nice. This place is beautiful. I'm going to... What? Hello? Riot? Riot? Oh my life. How does that hit? What? That glitched. I flashed. Why would it still hit me? No! I had my hands off my keyboard. Why is that warded, dude? Oh, I had my hands off of my mouse. I had no chance. In what world does that hit? Oh my god, we got a dragon. Worth. Dude. Oh, I'm tilted off that. I mean, it would have been worse to die to a Moo Moo. Sona took damage, man. Her Seraph shield saved her. Well, maybe we can get a siege going because they're kind of low. Fight is flight. Only now I do not run. Got one. Oh my god. They don't die is the issue. Oh no, it's all in. This skin lives on me. Oh, sure, please. They don't die. Sona just keeps healing them. Hit the maiden. Kill the maiden. You guys, just hit the maiden. Why is it so hard? I ping it. Yeah, there you go. Kill I it. refuse to accept it as my fate. I was surrounded by nothingness, but I was never alone. Memories comfort like the um. I mean, they don't do Baron that fast if York's not there. But the problem is now York just splits, and I can't deal with him issue because those stupid little things just block. And my team's gonna lose every fight without me. So this is why I hate playing against split pushers. Now we lose Baron. Oh, we're just gonna lose. I knew this was a loss in champ select too. Like every single one of them gets away with one HP. It's crazy. They don't die because of Sona. Oh. 
There's nothing we could do. It literally takes four people to kill Yorick, and he's two and four. Hold out ground. It just Attack really, down. really sucks when you have no frontline, and the enemy team is all frontline. The only way we win is like 50 minute ace or something, but like Ezreal and Sona are just not dying even though I'm melting them. And they have a frontline tank immune. Who gets healed? The hunt is binary. Kill or be killed. Like, imagine if we had frontline to Ezreal eating into me every fight. Would not be able to do that. Oh, I actually got her. Holy. The thing is, we're just we're still losing this fight. Ezreal's got the wave behind us, and York's just ending the game. Just so cringe. Doesn't matter what I do, I just lose. Like, we can beat them in fights, but we're never getting anything in return. Just because they have split pushers in Baron. And they have counters to me. This is my purpose. Learn from me. Too slow. But I've been trying to play Yorick all week in every game. I'm able to get matched by five people and my team does nothing. But of course, when he's on the enemy team, he gets to just free push. We, if they get next Baron, we just lose though. We can't give him another Baron. Because we, we can't even defend their split without it, so. Stay alert. Stay aggressive. Okay, I don't see anything bomb. Oh, what do you know? His stupid ghouls blocked my snipe. Oh, he one shot the turret. And I'm, I can't even kill the ghouls, are you joking? We, we can't even leave base first, they're comp. So lame. I'm literally losing all my... The games I do lose playing this, it's due to draft gap. Like, literally just need a tank. You just need one tank on your team. How did he live? I ignited him. Oh, yeah, yeah, we just definitely lose. 
We have no wave clear. We have no tank. The Nidalee really screwed us over by running it down early. Unlucky. I can never play against Yorick and Nasus when I'm recording a video because it's just impossible to 1v5 against those champs. But they end the game if they get Baron, so it's like we, we're just screwed. Lose to Team Comp. You can counter your split pushing if you actually have people that can kill him. Unfortunately, we don't. Jace is not a champ that can kill him. I tried, guys. I tried. It's a 1v5 angle. Look at our base. <laughs> we just, we needed to not give up that first Baron. I don't know what happened. We just, we have no pressure on the map anywhere. We also have a full team of single target spells. But yeah, I called it was over as soon as Amumu got fed. Oh, well, we had some fun games. I mean, I still played really well this game. It's just, this is an impossible game. The best player in the world could not have won this one. Because we, we lost to minions. We didn't even lose to champions. I tried. Yeah, the, the Nidalee running it down early just made it really impossible to play. The Sona, even though she was like 0 and 4, was just healing them so much. And Sona wouldn't even die. She went Seraphs. Yeah, look at that. I wasn't even able to hit them, and I did 50k damage. Oh, well, GG. That's what this build loses to. Remember that. You need a tank on your team, and you need your team not to be full AP, and you need frontline. We didn't have any of that that game. 